A common misconception is that solar panels stop working if the panels are damaged or broken. In this demonstration, we've connected a series of 20 250 watt solar panels to create a 5 kilowatt solar system. If you look closely at the panels, you'll notice that the glass in each panel is shattered to simulate the damage that might be caused by an event such as a hailstorm. Next, we connect a voltage meter and an amperage meter to the array to measure the electrical output. As you can see, even though every panel in the solar system is damaged, the system is still producing over 650 volts open circuit and nearly 9 amps short circuit current. This is a lethal amount of DC electricity, as you can see by the electrical arc we're drawing between the positive and negative wiring. This demonstrates that even when every panel in the system is damaged, solar systems continue to produce potentially lethal amounts of DC electricity. Even when seriously damaged by fire, solar panels continue to be a serious safety risk. Next, we connect the voltage meter and the amperage meter to the solar panel frame to determine if the damaged panels are leaking electricity onto the frame. The voltage reading is only minor at between 12 and 15 volts, which poses no serious threat of injury. To simulate rain associated with a hailstorm or water being applied to an incident involving fire, we then apply water to the damaged array to see if water conductivity affects the amount of electricity that leaks onto the solar panel frame. The impact of water is dramatic. The voltage on the frame immediately jumps from between 12 and 15 volts up to nearly 300 volts, creating a potentially life-threatening risk. If the frame arcs onto metal roofing, this can electrify the roof, guttering, and ladders leaning against the roof. This demonstrates that when responding to incidents involving damaged solar systems, such as clearing stormwater damage in wet conditions or attempting to extinguish fire with water, there is a threat of exposing emergency services personnel to unanticipated risks. In events such as short circuits, fires, floods or storms, PV Stop is the only fast, effective and safe way to shut down solar systems and mitigate the dangers associated with rooftop solar systems. PV Stop, making solar energy safe. <laughs>